Hello guys, welcome to My Dip for Fun. I'm Renee, a lesbian dipper. So today I got something completely different for you guys. Longhorn Long Cup Wintergreen. This is the can for your warning label, warning label. The can. First impressions. Looks like, uh, looks and feels like, um, the, those, uh, Jack's, um, beef jerky chew cans. Can feels like the same quality, everything. Real cheap plastic can. There's like the expiration of this Bama can. Real cheap can. Not too fancy. Gas station. That's a shit horn, as some people call it. Never really had it. If I have, I can't remember if I had it. So, not easily dip cheap. That cheap a dip. Actually, dip Chris or more, but you know, get your coupons for savings, long horn stuff. So, yeah, let's get. Crack this bad boy. I hope I get my nails in here. Okay, for some reason this thing does not want to crack like normal. Normally I can get my nails in there. What the world? Okay, so that's the thing. Every time I try to get my nail in there, it slips out. It doesn't have a place to really hook on there. That's the first time I have to use one of these. There we go, damn. Can't get my nail down there. Making YouTube notifications. Of course, like every time, I keep forgetting to bring my mud jug if I want to need to get one for work. So, I don't have to remember to bring it every time. Well, come on. Just crack it open, get the initial. The initial, is it wet? No, it's a little bit moist, not too bad. My whatever um, taste, the smell to it. Let's see how it packs. I'm trying to get my head cut off. Let's see how it packs. Of course you lose that little pinch for the dippy guards. Uh, I don't know, I'm just weird. I'm just going to go ahead and see how it packs. Bro, what the fuck? So it is, okay, okay, so first impressions. I'm going to dip it. Uh, it's fine, it's, a little, it's a long cut, but it's finer than, way finer than, in my opinion, I feel like way finer than the Grizzly. And so, yeah, it kind of fell apart. I'm not the best at pinching, but, you know. It just falls apart, look at that. It just falls freaking apart, and make a mess. Mmm. Ugh. No initial flavor, kind of disgusting. Don't really like. I wish they would. I wish the companies would do like full, like whole tin cans like they used to. I don't like it. I don't like the flavor. Mmm. It tastes like if somebody tried to make their own own homemade chew and fucked it up. This product is not a safe alternative cigarette. Longhorn is probably definitely not a health alternative safe cigarette. Who knows what the hell they do with like the scraps off the damn floor from the cigarette company. Mm-mm. Yeah, nicotine kicking in, but... I mean, I feel like with any... chew or any dips, you're gonna get a nicotine buzz if you don't dip that often. So... I don't dip that often, but I do dip once in a great... once in a... Well, I mean, I don't dip like a like everybody else. I don't know if it's because I put a, I normally put it a little bit bigger, but I can't pinch it, and it's kind of going all over the place. Which is very generic. I, I understand why nobody really gets this. I knew one guy who did, but... Well, he got Timberwolf, but... Oh, no. So, first time for everything. See, right there. Alright, I'm back. That's just not working. That was disgusting. Yeah, long one. Definitely, there's other better um, budget dips out there. I think Timberwolf is probably better than this. Longhorn is not very. Wouldn't recommend it. It's pretty shitty. You guys dip out, if you guys if somebody dips on dips this on a regular, let me know. I'm not complaining. I'm not gonna judge. This is still better than nothing. 
It's one of the worst winter greens I've had, and I the pouches the pouches that the wintergreen pouches that I dip are way better than this damn thing. I'm not saying something. Usually, this, usually the usually the loose stuff um, has more flavor than the pouches. So the pouches usually milder, but for some reason the pouches that I dip have way more flavor, way better. Long cut. And of course, the other long cuts that I dip, the other wood greens that I dip are fortunately better because it's grizzly wood green. So, you can't, you know. Uh, I don't know what else to say. Plastic can, all the way around. Couldn't even fucking break the seal on it because my hand kept flipping. I had to literally puncture it to break it open. Normally, I can just get my thumb in there and just go around. I don't have, I mean, I have enough to dig in there, so I don't really know. Let me know you guys' takes on this. If you guys like it or not. I'm gonna keep this just as an emergency, I guess, you know, when I'm completely out of all my other stuff and I don't, can't run to the store. But, this part is gonna go in my fridge, I'm not gonna do much with it. I don't wanna waste dips, so. I'm just gonna keep it as a very backup. I'll have to come back in a few days, see how long. You know, I think this, this thing looks like it's just gonna dry out within a few days. So. This thing looks, cause it's like moist, but it's not. I mean, it's moist enough to be considered not dry. But, you know. So, make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, and I'm Renee, let me dipper, this is I dip for fun, keep dipping for fun, see you in the next one, we'll have a mud jug then, so I don't have to fit out one of these again, and so I don't forget my home, but you guys take care, have a good one, let's do the rock and roll in outro, peace.